we're gonna go over how to switch your mortgage to another lender to take advantage of mortgage terms and rates. Let's do this. How's it going? My name is John and I am a mortgage broker located in Canada and welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you wanna learn ways to be approved for a mortgage, home buying tips and other mortgage related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the notification button so you won't miss anything. Rates are currently at record lows. Although it's easier to stick with your existing lender, you may be able to save thousands of dollars by switching your mortgage to another lender to take advantage of preferred rates and features. I'm going to share with you step-by-step step how to do this, starting with step number one. Check when your mortgage matures. Generally, a standard mortgage will have a maturity date of within five years. And on that specific day, you have the option to take your mortgage to another bank without any penalty. When you have less than four months until the maturity date, that's the best time to inquire on different rates and options. The trend is if your mortgage amount is more than 80% or less than 70% of the market value of your property, chances are you will receive a much more competitive offer than your existing bank. The reason is because the types of mortgage are often backed up by the Canadian government. And in the eyes of other banks and lenders, your mortgage is considered low risk, therefore lower interest rate. And how about those who are paying a higher rate, but the mortgage maturity date is still in a couple of years? Well, you can still consider switching your mortgage to get a lower interest rate, but it's important to connect with your existing bank and ask what your penalty will be for breaking the term. Generally, if you're in a variable rate mortgage, your penalty is capped at three months interest. But if you're in a fixed rate mortgage, expect a penalty to be much higher. Once we know what your penalty is, then we can run the numbers to see if it's worthwhile to still switch even though you'll need to pay a penalty. After discussing different rates and options and if switching still works out better for you, then we go on to step number two the mortgage application. Although you've had this mortgage for a few years, when you're moving your mortgage to another lender, this new lender views it as a brand new mortgage. Therefore, you'll need to be qualified at the current mortgage rates and policies and financial situation. Documents that we'll need are your employment documents like employment letter and pay stubs, mortgage statement, and property tax statement. It usually takes about three to five business days for the lender to decide whether or not you're approved and what conditions are required. Once you've got the approval, then we go on to the last step, step number three, making it official. A solicitor will be required to facilitate the switch and update the title of registration. Your bank will be notified to provide a payout statement and it will show the final balance owing in order to pay them out. Once the final amount is set and paperwork is signed, then your solicitor will be in charge of directing the funds from your new lender to pay out your previous mortgage. And there you go. We just went over how to switch your mortgage to another lender to take advantage of mortgage terms and rates. And please remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel to learn more and make sure you click on the notification button so you won't miss a video. I'm John Lee, mortgage broker and CEO of Arise Mortgage. We are always achieving your approval.